Hey YouTube, this is Seth McDonald, and I am back with another top video of today. Today is my birthday. Um, I'm turning 33 today, and basically, you know, come to think of it, man. Um, I basically been turning all my life. And, you know, over the years, um, I, you know, I thought about just quitting on it and just, you know, giving up on it. And, and I, I look back now and pat myself on the back for staying with it all this time. No matter how hard life got for me in my past and where I was living at, at the time, and when I moved down here about a year ago um, to what happened in the past on with my other family that I had back back then. Um, I thought they was somebody that I could trust, and then, um, they turned around, turned on me, and basically tried to hurt me about a year ago, and, um, from now, and, um, basically, um, that's the reason why I'm, you know, staying in shape, you know, doing the martial arts, um, is to learn to protect myself, learn... You know, to not ever let that happen again on how it happened. Um, to better myself. Um, to be a better person than what I was in the past. Um, in the past, I made a lot of bad choices. Um, I wish I would have never done. Um, but when I made those bad choices, I was with... One person that kind of provoked me to make those bad choices. And that's the reason why I felt like when I was around that one person, I I felt like I was around that one person. Like, I couldn't really end up being, you know, being myself when I was around that one person. And I, I just couldn't just, you know, you know, show the real me. And that's what I'm trying to say. Show, show the real me on who I am and what I'm capable of and what I'm about. I'm almost about, um, I'm almost about, I was around that for... six years of my life and as of right now I am doing a lot better than where I was um always thinking positive um never looked back to that area again and the only thing that it's done is made me stronger on who I am on the inside and you know, basically a lot of people, they have a hard time dealing <laughs> when they get confronted or assaulted. And only thing that saved me um, literally was me doing an arm bar on the person that was trying to hurt me, um, who I was staying with at the time. And, you know... Looking back on that situation, um, you know, I'm kind of glad I got out of that situation because if I would have stayed there any longer, um, living with them any longer, I would probably been, you know, hurt. I would probably been, you know, wind, winded up in the hospital just because um, of what happened. Um, later on down the road, um, I wouldn't know for sure if I would have stayed there on where I was living at about a, a year ago. And so, 
9 out of 10 when it comes to, you know, now everybody's always asking me, why am I staying positive? Why, why, why do I always have a smile on my face? Why, you know, why this, why that, why do I do the things? Um, I'll just tell them, I say, you know, I say, you don't know what I've been through. And I said, what do you mean? I said, I say, you just don't know what I've been through. And, you know, I learned, you know, to smile, you know, the reason why I smile is because, you know, you don't want to walk around with a frown face all the time. You don't want to walk around, um, you know, feeling miserable. And if you feel miserable all the time, uh, it blocks your chi flow through your body. Uh, plus, it makes you depressed. Um, it makes you into a person that uh, you don't want to be. And... I say if you, you know, I know there's probably a lot of people out there that's probably in a worse shape than one of I have been, but for what I've been through, um, I wouldn't really say chaos. Um, what I what I've kind of said is that say is is it's more like. I've been through hell and back, and um, sorry, part of my French, but I really can say it in any other way. Um, I was trying to say chaos, but it's not really chaos. Um, but it was more like hell and back um, in my past about a year ago, and um, where I'm at today is maybe into a better person and maybe into. Uh, more respectful to others, more, uh, uh, positive, uh, more, uh, disciplined in my art, uh, more disciplined in my physical, and more disciplined in my job, and learning to save money on top of it, and, you know, just believing that I can do anything I want, um, uh, and believing in myself that I can do it, you know, and learn it. And, um, but other than that, that's the whole side of me that most people don't really understand. Um, when it comes to being self, you know, I'm usually quiet. I'm usually like the quiet one sometimes. But once I open up to you and, you know, if if I just meet you, yeah, I'll be quiet at first, but, like, once I open up to you, you know, and say, hey, you know, how you doing, start talking to you, you know, I might say one or two words, and, you know, if I know you're a hard worker, and if I know you, you know, as a good startup conversation person, I'll talk to you, you know, it's just a respect thing, but, you know, you turn around and disrespect me in a certain way, yeah, I'm not going to hang around you. I'm not going to talk to you. And, um, you know, that, that, that's just how I am. And when it comes to learning, you no, know, from my past mistakes and growing from it, uh, it makes us into a better person on what, how we learn from it. Uh, is it still there? Um, is the pain still there? Because uh, you thought the ones you loved, uh, that you were staying with at the time, you know, you could trust them and everything else. And you thought they was family. And... Um, and it turned out that, I didn't, that they didn't really care about you one bit. And, you know, to me, that, that's a sad situation, um, all in one. But, it's just on how you look at it, you know, when all that's happened to you. And now you're in a new area, everybody's trying to help you out. Um, just be truthful, be honest. 
and uh, honesty comes a long way. Uh, that's all I gotta say. Honesty comes a long way, and no matter what you do in life, uh, even if you get in trouble for it, you know, honesty is better being honest about it than turn around and make up a light lie about it than basically, you know. On that part itself, uh, I did, you know, I, you know, learned from the past, and, you know, yeah, I made stupid choices, and, you know, I'm not gonna lie, you know, um, what, what I've done in the past, and what I have, um, but, you know, we all make stupid choices, you know, we're all not perfect in, in, this, what, in this world. You know, we was all perfect in this world, we'll be, um, we'll be basically um, in a boring world, pretty much. And, that, and that's the thing, we'll be basically in a boring world, we'll... If everybody was perfect, never made a mistake, and continuously, um, that's just how I see it. And, you know, I'm 33 years old. Um, nobody's perfect. You know, we all make um, stupid choices. We all um, live and learn from it. You know, that's how we grow. That's how we grow to be a better person. Um, learn from the past, um, from that hurting experience, and learn, you know, learning to grow from it. Making you into a better person than what you are were back then. Um, making you into an adult as you are today. Uh, do I live with my grandparents? Yes. Um, they're older than I am. I help them out because I'm younger. Um, I'm just trying to save up money for my own place. I'm setting small goals. Um, I got me a new car. Uh, Trade my old one in for a newer one. Um, it's a 2014 Equinox Chevrolet SUV, um, very nice car, brand new, never been in a wreck. Um, but other than that, um, I really like it. It's better than the car that I did have. Um, even though I love that Pontiac GT, but there was just a lot of things wrong with it. And I didn't want to put in the money just to get it fixed. So I decided, well... Maybe somebody will trade it off for me and let, let them deal with it. So I just, I was just honest and I said, yeah, it's been in a wreck. Uh, yeah, there are some things wrong with it, but I'm on a different car and that's what I was told to dealership. And he's like, okay, you know, you're honest about it. I'm going to be honest with you. And so... That's how I done it, and you know, honesty comes a long way uh, when it comes to things, and just be truthful, just be yourself, be who you are. Um, check out my new outdoor training videos that I made, and I'll talk to y'all later, and God bless. On this beautiful Sunday, and just, like I said, just be yourself, be who you are, um, be who you want to be. Don't let nobody else change you on who you are. Um, stay positive no matter how bad your life gets. And, you know, there's always a positive side to it. And that's the thing. Um, just be yourself and you'll come a long way. And, and have faith and have heart in doing what you're doing. And just take your time doing it. And... You know, we got a whole life ahead of us, and um, that's the thing. Just be yourself, be who you are, and God bless. Peace.